Hello, in front of me I have Redmi 15C and in this video I'm going to show the speed up tricks on this device. Alright, so let's begin. So I've been using this device for, for a while and I think uh, I know the best uh, speed up tricks and might be some that you didn't know about. So uh, let's open up the settings first. Let's open up the about phone, which is on the top. And now we need to tap on the OS version. Thanks to that, we will be able to open up the developer settings. Uh, and in that settings, uh, we can change uh, four, uh, four things. So let's tap on the OS version a few times, just like that. Mm, if you have a screen lock, uh, you'll need to type it or draw it. If you have a pattern, and we can see now that we are now a developer. All right, so thanks to that, we can go back. Now let's scroll down into the bottom, click on additional settings. Scroll down a little, and in here we have the developer options. So let's open them up, and now we need to scroll down until we find uh, four specific options. I'll show you which one. Uh, here are the first three: An animated duration scale, transition animation scale, and the window animation scale. As you can see, all three of them are currently set on one X. It's a default value, uh, but to improve the speed and the performance of our device, we can set them on 0.5, or we can completely turn them off. Uh, in my opinion, 0.5 is like a perfect balance between 1x and off, because thanks to that we, st uh, thanks to that, we still have some mm, animation that are not completely uh, turned off. So, in my opinion, it's the best uh, settings that we can uh, set. Now let's scroll down a little until we find the apps, and in here we have the background process limit. It's set on standard, uh, but to improve, we can set at most three or at most four processes. It's up to you. And that's basically all that we need to do in the developer options. So we can go back and now let's go straight into the apps. Let's wait a few seconds. And in here we have a list of all apps that are installed on our device. Uh, and simply, if you have some of the apps that you are not using or you use them very rarely, simply uninstall them. So, uh, for example, uh, I need to find some of the apps. Uh, remember that some of those apps are the system apps and they are not uh, available to uh, to uninstall them. Uh, simply uh, don't even touch them because you, by mistake you can do something wrong and it will be bad. <laughs> so, but for example, Netflix isn't a system app. And basically, when, when you are not using it, you can simply click on uninstall, click on OK. Thanks to that, we gained some free storage space and our device will work a little bit faster. Uh, remem remember that uh, some of the apps you can uninstall simply from the home screen. So, for example, in here we have a TikTok, hold on the icon, and in here we have that uh, bin icon. Simply tap on that, and thanks to that, you'll also be able to uninstall the app. Also, in some of the apps, uh, not in all of them, but uh, for example, in the Chrome, it should be available. Uh, there is a chance for uh, clearing the uh, the cache. Yeah, here it is. So, click on the storage. Uh, it doesn't only work uh, on Chrome. Uh, it works with other apps, uh, not all of them. Uh, but in my case, I'll show you on the Chrome. Uh, click on the storage. Now click on clear data and click on clear cache. Click on OK. And also clearing the cache uh, won't uh, delete your uh, personal data or anything like that. Uh, you won't lose every anything, so don't worry. But thanks to that, thanks that uh, deleting, you can gain some free speed. All right, now we can go back from here and let's go straight into our home screen. Now let's click on the security. Let's wait a few seconds, because it's scanning. Okay, it says uh, that a few items can be optimized. Click on the button. Let's wait until everything gets optimized. From time to time, you can take a look right in here, if you have something to delete. Okay, it's still scanning, so let's wait.
all right a few items can be optimized for example we can uh, turn on plus two on the xiaomi cloud uh, but it, it's it requires it requires uh, logging but we have other uh, uh, problems that we can solve we can click on fix now okay let's wait okay one issue requires uh, optimization it's about the battery usage let's click on the restrict and here we can mm, turn off those apps that are that can start in the background it's completely up to you all right as you can see other things also has been cleared we can also manually open up the cleaner now let's wait until everything gets scanned and we can clean one megabyte not much but always okay currently we have a ad so we need to wait all right in here also you can perform a deep clean or uninstall the apps let's click on, let's click on the deep clean for example okay and we can uninstall up to uh, 36 apps that uh, that are the apps that we are not uh, even using uh, if you want you can of course uh, uninstall them and also you can clear up data all right also when you are using your device from time to time you can open up your recent apps and if you have a lot of them uh, opened in the background simply close them because it frees up uh, the ram of your device and thanks to that your device might work faster also when it comes to the cleaning apps you can also download more from the play store simply type cleaner or cleaning uh, and you will have a list of uh, apps that can help with the uh, cleaning uh, the junk files of your uh, device before downloading it's always good to uh, read some reviews about them all right and as a last thing i'll show you how to perform a simple uh, reboot of the device it also might help with the speed of your device so first let's open up the power menu we do it by clicking the power button and volume up button just like that and now drag this white ball into the reboot now release your finger and now within a second our device will be turned on automatically and it, and it will be again ready to use also performing a simple reboot uh, is good for your device uh, health because during that process you simply close the processes that are running in the background and it also frees up some RAM. All right, that's all in this, in, in this video. Thank you all for watching. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe.